All right, welcome everybody. Here we are. We're going to be finally jumping into Far Cry 6. Now, um, it's been a little bit since we played Far Cry. We did uh, Far Cry 5, uh, 4, and 3 on the channel already. If you guys haven't checked those out, go check it out. Um, now, I did play a little bit of Far Cry 6 when the game first came out. Um, I skipped all the other games, never played a Far Cry game, jumped straight into 6. We played a little bit of on the channel. This was way back in the day before I was more of a variety content creator. And um, it didn't do very well. So I kind of was like, you know what? Let me stop playing this. Um, I want to play the other Far Cries, and then we'll come back to it, you know, once I'm a little more uh, accustomed to the Far Cry universe. So now here we are, guys. I'm excited for this one. Remember, if you guys want to see more Far Cry 6, hey, just smash that like button. It's the best way to let me know. Um, and if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. Now, this game is on sale right now on Steam for like 15 bucks. It's crazy cheap. So uh, definitely go check that out. Tojo, thank you for the gifted, brother. I appreciate that. All right. So let's, uh, my dogs are crazy. So sorry if you guys. Now, um, this game does have copyright music in it. I did go ahead and turn the music off. So some of the scenes might be weird, um, but we'll see going forward. All right, so select the difficulty. Gorilla mode is the hardcore for those who want to test their skills. Action mode is the classic experience. Yeah, so we'll just go action for right now. <clears throat> Anderson, what's up, brother? How you doing? I'll take it gorilla is like the hard mode. Um, action's like the normal mode, and then story is probably the easy. Vic, how you doing today? FVM, how you doing? Martin, I appreciate all you guys for coming. Oh, action's even harder, really? Uh, it, it's all good. It's too late now. Yara is an island in the heart of the Caribbean. So isn't this supposed to be like, uh, like, like Cuba or something like that? Benton Castillo. My true Yarns, I stand before you armed with truth. For too long, our country was stolen by politicians. But you elected a vision, a cure, a road to paradise. Viviro, created by our own brilliant scientists, the most effective treatment for cancer the world has ever seen, grown within our precious tobacco, modified with the purest fertilizer, Viviro is the key to rebuild paradise. But our paradise comes at a cost. This our enemies will never understand. Yara did not elect me to do what's easy, but to do what's right. And so, with renewed focus, I must extend the draft to paradise. True Yarans from across our island, chosen to produce enough Viviro to heal the world and save our country. These lucky Yarans will be chosen by random lottery. These dudes are savage, man. Hey, Danny. And like a true Yaren, he Turn will that shit off. With a smile on his face. Precisamente. Exactly what Castillo wants. Enough politics, Lita. You think the draft is only taking true Yarens? It's the outcasts, the poor, orphans like us. He's bringing slavery back from the dead in Yara. You can't run from this. Hang on. You ditched us. Ran off to the jungle with a bunch of guerrillas. Libertad. Hmm? And you're back here to recruit for Clara Garcia's local crusade? Come on, this is our big goodbye. Danny, fucking say something. Oh, so you could... Oh, you could switch between the male and the female. Okay. Uh, we'll go. We'll go with the male. They got my name wrong. Danny, you could help Libertad. You're trained. Would have been career military if you weren't such a fuck up. <laughs> Just come with us, Lita. Aye, you never fucking listen, Danny. Hey, time Pick with to the go. five gifted memberships. Thank Both you so waiting. much, brother. Drinks in Mexico. Dinner in Miami. Coño! Fucking blackout. Too big for a blackout. You're fucking packing? Oh yeah! What's going on? Rafis must report for duty. You can join us to reveal 
That was a good idea, man. We have to go. Now! The boat. You're coming. You will join Promise us me, Lita. See. Come on, Danny. Okay, then. When we get to Miami, we'll say goodbye to Alejo. I promise. On the arms, get out. stay out of sight. Okay. Okay, watch the detection meter. Stay out of sight. Okay, we're good to go. Hey, Rojas, should have answered the call. Next asshole who opens the door is Danny Rojas. Come on. Uh, when I ran the benchmark, I was getting about 90 frames per second on average. Like between like 80 and 90. This way. Okay, okay. I'm not resisting. I'm not resisting. What the fuck? Come on. I have a family. Shit. Come on, we gotta move. Uh, but Vic again with the five gifted members, brother. Thank you so much, man. Is the stream lagging? Of course it would. You know how it is, guys. Give the stream a second to uh, catch up with itself. <clears throat> Am I on FSR? I don't I don't know what that means. Uh when I put the option let me see. Yo. Quality. I turned all this crap on. Um Yeah, and I turned FSR on to ultra quality. No, no, I know the the stream's lagging for sure. Yeah, yeah. No, I can I can see that the, it, it, there's a bad buffer. Uh, so the 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 stream isn't lagging from uh the game chat. The, the, it's not the game that's causing the lag. It's just the internet. Like sometimes this just happens. Uh, we get bad internet connections with YouTube sometimes, and it's just sometimes it'll clear up in a few minutes, and uh, other times it'll give you a hard time.
So it doesn't seem like I have the consistent bet buffer right now. No, no. Yeah, we don't we don't have fiber where I live, <clears throat> so I don't, I don't. We don't have the greatest of it. Waiting to see if this damn. Because YouTube puts up a, a like an error. It says like, error. YouTube is not receiving data to maintain. Such viewers will experience buffering. Ah, uh, Anderson, brother, thank you, thank you for the super chat, man. Nah, that's all good, man. I'm excited for this one. Uh, everything was working good. Uh, have I played any of the Just Cause series? No, no, I've never played. Yeah, it, it, that's what I tried saying. It's not the game that's doing it. It's just my. The banner went away. Might be okay. Like, once you're good. Says my connection's good. Uh, we'll, we'll, I'll keep, I'll keep monitoring it. Uh, sorry for those for you. Deal with this. Um, uh, hopefully it stays good. Keep it going. Hopefully it's good. We need to get across that square. They're going to see us. No, they don't. Trust me. Come out and stand before your home. Any resistance will be met with lethal force. A lot of soldiers like that. So we take the sewers. We're we supposed to do it against a whole tank. Stop the super super chat. Thank you so much, brother. They didn't check off. Ready, Danny? Again, Douglas, thank you so much for the super chat. I appreciate it. I, I'm glad you're enjoying the content. Yo, we're in the, we're in the sewer now, so we gotta follow the blue arrows. I'll take it. Reaper King with the four months. Thank you, thank you.
Like, why are they? I thought they were trying to draft people. Why are they savagely murdering everybody? They went this way. Keep going. So much blood. That boat's not going to wait for us. Gally with the 17 months, thank you so much. Savage as hell, man. Where the fuck are the police? They're just letting the military kill us. La noche de la muerte. The boat's over there. Run! Lita. We're almost there. There it is. Please, we have to get on that boat. Abuela, what the hell I'm gonna do with baseball cards? Do you have any idea what these are worth? Let us through. Oh, yeah. Marco, always making new friends. Danny, you're late. Where's Alejo? Give up his sticky. Or his family. Bullshit. Alejo is an orphan. Alejo's not going anywhere anymore. Come on, Marco. Let them on. Vamos. Good man. Get on the box and go. Let us on. Uh, AC Valhalla. We'll be we'll be going back to it in a, in a bit. Um, Don't worry about it, Chimaco. Here. Played it for it's a very a long time, and uh, viewership kind of tanked on it, so Danny. we're just taking a break from it for a bit. Running to the young geese. Alejo gave you a fucking gift, Lita. We survive. Same as the orphanage, same as the academy. What's that? No, no, no. I didn't even try to hide, man. Before he was El Presidente, me papa loved to fish. We would go out on a boat, just like this, and we would catch the fish and then release them. He would say, it's not always about your stomach, mijo. It's about the challenge, except when he caught a big, fat, juicy marlin. <laughs> he was too proud to let that fish go. Sick, Tirano! You have boys, I 
And yet are you a bite on your sword? I have caught a very big fish today. Haven't I, Diego? Diego! No way. I have caught you, Diego. son? Now it's time to bring you home. I don't want this anymore, Papa. We have no choice. Let them go. They can work. Make vivido. Truth or lies? Truth. They could be good workers. They could help rebuild paradise. But if you wanted them to live, you would have never set foot on this fucking boat. Thirteen years old. And Diego has such compassion for his people. These fish? We will catch and release. What the hell just happened? I think we're fucked. Vamos, vamos! I can't feel my legs. Fuck. This is all my fault. My phone. Yeah, forget it, Lita. My phone. This is the beach, Danny. It's fucking fate. What? She's hiding here. Clara. Libertad. Julio. Fuck. Julio. It's all here. Take my phone. Follow the code like when we were kids. Stop, Elita. Just wait. I'll find help. No. You give her this. Clara will help you. Don't you get it? You're the lucky one, Danny. You're the lucky one. Yes. I'm glad you enjoyed it, Anderson. You're gonna love the so ride. Many dead. It was amazing. Go on. I should look for supplies and get the fuck out of here. So we got a melee weapon. No guns, though, at the moment. Oh, there it is. Shit. Pistol's empty. Got a PMM right there. Need to find that gun. How the fuck is this still working? The markings must be the code Lita was talking about. Old military, like World War II style bunkers here or something? <clears throat> Might be able to get some ammo. So we gotta Looks follow like these blue arrows. The route to Yep. 
blue armband. Must be Liberta. Take the spray paint mark trail as your markers will guide us safely through the countryside towards our caches away from patrols. Blue is the true color of our flag, not that raccoon. Yeah, okay. Your family will probably never know what happened to you. Who's shooting? Better stay quiet. I swear, the Tiaran got me to smell this thing like animals. I can smell it on your clothes, your sweat. It's the stink of its later. <gasps> All rotten on the inside. How did I know you were scavenging for Liberta? I smelled it on you. That's why you died. Now I'm going to call this. Oh, that's pretty savage. <laughs> I'm not the only one looking for Clara. This. What's this? Could be useful. Munitions, pants, leg gear. But improve sidearm. Okay. Okay, so the, the clothes actually give you like a little bonus. Get to Libertà. Steal a boat. Sell the fuck out of yard. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Just stay cool. Oh. Okay. I wonder if you could skin them. Oh, so you just automatically get the meat? You don't even have to skin them? That thing was tanky as hell. Bad time to be a guerrilla. Been a while since I used one of these. Where did they first introduce the grapple? Was it Far Cry? Was it four? I think the first time I used it was in um in, in Primal. They didn't have one in three, I'm sure. But I played Primal before I played Far Cry Four, so that's why it's a little out of sync for me. I'm gonna show your face before you shoot me. I'm Danny, a friend of Lita. Silencio. You are the only survivor? Lara. Answer me. I said, are you the only survivor? See, si. Lucky. Need to know the risks. That's all you have to say? You're here. That's what matters. Just a second, hermana. I'm getting the hell out of Yara. <laughs> but you're in my camp. I need a place to stay. A few days. Libertas no charity, hermano. Lita said you would help. Lita also said you weren't a pussy. Come mierda! <laughs> You're an orphan, see? Funny how friends can be closer than family. Remember, Danny? Castillo has kept you an orphan. Why do you want to run? I watched Castillo order a whole boat of our people shot to death. Get as far away as you can from that psychopath. All of you. <laughs> when tyranny is law, revolution is order. Gordon Bolivar won't save you. It's Pedro Albizu. Gonna save Yara with library cards? I have a list. Free elections, free expression, free the outcasts. A Yara free of Castillos. Simple. Simple? Castillos got what? 
300,000 troops. I count six burnt-out guerrillas and you with a bullet to the leg. You don't believe me? I'll show you. We launched an attack from our base to this island. It was a basic operation. Hit a Viviro tobacco plantation, snatch some fuel, and go home. But Castillo's forces were waiting. Got us down from 60 to 6. You need to get back to your base. Yes, but this island is surrounded by a blockade. We don't have boats, we don't have much gear. And we are not leaving until that Viviro plantation goes up in smoke. But we are guerrillas. We know this land inside out. You're already familiar with our guerrilla paths. They were built by the legends in 67. They're spread like a web across all of Yara. Now, they're ours. Guerrilla paths are good to ambush soldados or to hide if the army is on your back. They have caches that will help you survive. And all this is legit? This map is old as hell. Made for turistas, yeah, it's out of date, but you got the regions, municipalities, and landmarks of Yara. He'll get used to it. Now I need to call in some favors with the locals to get us a boat, and you need to go find me Juan Cortez. Who? Someone who can make one guerrilla fight like a thousand. Seems like a pretty good sized map. Mario, thank you so much for the super chat, but I appreciate it. How you doing? Random gaming with the super chat. You know I'm not a guerrilla, Nick. right? You tell me to them. I'll give you food, a bed. Even and, uh, I got them both to sail to you're not gonna Yankees, be able to, you're not gonna be able to give me with that. You and I'm, blood. I'm too slick, brother. You can shoot, so shoot. Settle in, and let me know when you want to pay your rent. And uh, Jack Ross, what's going on? Thank you for the re-up on the membership. Danny. Got your oh, oh, okay. So that's not the whoa. It's got a pretty big map. I thought this was the the map, and then I seen this bit, and I was like, oh, okay. And then I, yeah, this is a huge map. Okay, so this is the uh. This is the uh, island we got to take back over at some point, but yeah, it's big, guys. I mean, I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's not. I don't know. It seems pretty big to me, though. And it's not like just a bunch of like open nothingness. It seems like there's a lot of infrastructure spread out throughout all this. All right, it's pretty dope. All right, let's see what we got going here. So, first job. I attacked this archipelago with a man named Juan Cortez. He helped me build Libertad from the dirt. Juan's a spy master from the pre Castillo days. Can build an ICBM from a goddamn ice cube tray. Pulled off ops for Espinosa, the KGB, then flipped to the CIA and Mossad for fun. Juan is my mentor. He's also unstable and an alcoholic. When shit went south, he was so embarrassed, he walked straight out of my camp. Castillo soldados would love nothing more than to capture a double agent like Cortez. I need him back with Libertad, Danny. He's done with us, but you're a fresh face. Take this earpiece. Juan made them for comms. Got a then nice AK. Yeah. If I were you, I would check the bar first. Get down to that village and bring me Cortez. I hope for your sake he's sober. Easy enough. Let me see if there's anything else around here. You refill ammo. Collect scraps. I said I played this game a little bit when it first came out. I don't really remember all that much about. It. I'm pretty sure you can like. I don't know how you. Okay, so we got a foul. All right. You can customize guns, right? Well, maybe it's because I don't have any stuff right now. 
Oh, you could paint it and everything? Alright, we'll throw some paint on that bad boy. And then we got our handgun here. What's the problem? Let's head down to this first mission. Bell's got nice sights. Danny, how's the earpiece? Can you hear me okay? Loud and clear. This spy shit works, Clara. I'll give you that. Bien. Keep your gun holstered if you want to stay out of trouble. Especially in areas with a lot of soldados. Si. Each. I got it. Okay, nice. A smart guerrilla picks their battles. Suerte. Now, I wonder if that shit actually matters. Holstering your weapon. Approach soldiers too closely, they'll draw suspicion. Um, okay. Then you can unholster like that. Pretty good sized town. Looks cool. I don't I love this vibe. We're looking for a man named Juan Cortez. I don't know the name. Do you think you're soldiers all over? What you are doing? <gasps> Papers. I don't have them on me anymore. Look. Here we go. That looks like a Juan. Yeah, I turned the music off. In the worst fucking cantina in Yara, or is it Colombia? Kirat, Chechnya. Dude doesn't seem like he's hiding. <laughs> he's sitting right out in the open. Leave the bottle. Let's work for you. Another. Guapo, you listen. Rule 16. A guerrero's revolution never ends. Always another war, another cantina, another ugly bartender. Juan Cortez. What do you think gave it away, Guapo? This isn't a fucking zoo, abuelo. Clara sent me to find you. Si. I learned long ago never to doubt her. You will too. Hey, I know you. Don't think so. Yeah, I know you. It's like I'm looking at a mirror, Wapo. What are you talking about? Those eyes, Guerrilla. You got a taste. You convince yourself you're a hero, but you wake up a junkie, just like Juan Cortez. This is a fucking waste of time. Can you whistle? What? Nah, you can't whistle. Oh, shit. You fucking rat. You're worth more dead anyway. The fuck? See, Wapo is in love with you, and I ruined the only copy of my book. Bueno, mis socios, vámonos. Once again, we have outstayed our welcome. <laughs> oh, there it is. Well, I think we got baddies coming up right. <laughs> Got a little bit of recoil on it. Truck. Nothing is over until we say. 
There it is. Okay, we're good. Let's get the hell out of here before the whole fucking army shows up. I'm drunk, but I'm not that drunk. Right behind you, old man. Wapo wants to be your friend. Or maybe he just needs to take a dump. Only one way to find out. Is so Guapo's actually my friend? Come on, let's get the fuck out of here. You're more distracted Ooh, Guapo. than a fucked up an alligator, dude. Shut up. I can tell you handled a gun before. What's your name? Danny. So Clara says you're a legend. Ex-KGB, ex-CIA. <laughs> I got more fucking exes than your porn search history. Some men, they break eggs for breakfast. But Juan Cortez, he breaks fucking countries. Hold up. New plan, Danny. Vamos. The plan is to go back to Clara's camp. Where the hell are we going now? See that smoke? That means the watchtower just got a supply drop with some of the rarest materials you'll find in Yara. And you are going to go get it. Now you want me to steal shit for you? Gunpowder and Supremo Bond. The cerveza and chaser of Resolver. I'm gonna teach you to make shit for weapons. Because making shit for weapons is cool. Sounds like a good and idea, man. number nine. Always use the right tool for the right job. You coming with me? Fuck no. You got guapo. You can tear shit up with him, but if you want to be sneaky, leave him behind. That cutie loves to make a mess. Am I going to play Scum again? Yeah, yeah, if there's a... When there's a good bit of uh, updates. But there's so many... The thing is, guys, there's so many games out there that I have not played yet that replaying games is not really an option at the moment. Like, there's no reason for me to replay Scum right now. There's still a billion survival games out there we haven't tried and it's not like i'll be doing anything new in scum if i played it again right now because they haven't really added anything new to the game they've just banned them Gators and fence gators. A message from the line of Yada, Presidente Anton Castillo. A true Yana is not striking by the road. So I wonder if they have like the, the thing where you can like do the scouting like you could in the other Far Cries and mark people. No crocs allowed here. Five meters spread! Move! How is she talking about? Oh, uh, we've played all the Dark Picture games on the channel so far. Get that croc away from here. I was hoping that... Oh. Croc, get over there, boy. Crocodile's actually, uh... Like scaring her away. I attended a funeral today. One of our soldiers. One of our finest. Here we go. A famous young With the blood of patriots. That is a lie. The only blood I want to see is the blood of the Libertad Terroristas. We will squeeze them dry. I can't do that from right there. There, again. Adios! It's 
So I don't have any, uh, like, suppressors or anything like that, so if I shoot, we're gonna be going loud. So until we have to, we'll just take these guys out. Clear out the top part here. A special announcement from El Presidente Anton Castillo. Juan, I can't find this shit. Don't give up now, Daddy. This is situation critical. Fucking zero hour, life or death. Look for a military case. Coño, why don't you come and look for yourself, old man? Because Ooh, we just got a new rifle. MS-16, wasn't it? Oh yeah, this is that, uh... It's kind of like a sniper rifle. Well, I guess you could say it's more of like a DMR. All the way down to the nub of this cigar, but smoking is banned inside buildings. God damn you. So we got this military drop here, obviously. wonder why these are all marked. I guess this could be useful. What the hell are you going to do with this one? Right, one more. Seems like we got to check that out at some point. It looks like it could be something interesting in there. More shit for one. Found all your shit, one. Good work, Danny. Now hurry up already. We need to get back to Clara's camp. That's what I've been saying. Good. Like a true gorilla right there, chat. Okay, we got more than enough. Let's get the fuck out of here. So what's with all this junk? You building something? Patience, Danny. Rule number eight. A guerrilla knows how to wait. Like a spider or a serial killer. So, how did you get to this godforsaken hellhole? I was on a refugee ship. We didn't get far. Yeah, yeah. And I came here on a chopper in our baby invasion of Santuario. Shot straight out of the goddamn sky. No, I mean, what's your story? The orphanage in Esperanza. Than the military. I'm no guerrilla, just helping Clara out until she gets me off this island. Rule 20. Once a guerrilla, always a guerrilla. Enough with that shit. Too late. The horse is out of the barn, and now the fucking cocaine is all over the kids, Danny. There is no other option. We'll be we playing some GTA tonight. <laughs> of course. And you think Americans want your Yaran blood? The American dream is for Americans, Danny. You don't quit, do you? Nope. Guapo hates quitters. Coño. If you two are so close, why is he following me? Guapo goes with those who need him most. Like those therapy dogs in your precious America. You can trust Guapo with your life. Yeah. Not sure I'm there yet. You got time. You said your chopper was shot down in the invasion. Can you fix it? So I can fly you to the Yankees? No, that's... It's grounded, but I'm working on it. Patience, Danny. Now it's time for Juan Cortez to show you how to make something out of nothing. Did I ever tell you rule number nine? You just did. That was rule number eight. use the right tool for the right job. Words to live by. Okay. It's a nice location. I mean, honestly, you would have a hard time storming this on ground with armored vehicles and shit like that. But if they have helicopters and shit, this this place would get leveled. How many others? The legend returns. The legend needs to piss, Hefa. Who's she? She was a journalist who dared call Anton Fascista. Now she's an outcast, a slave for his paradise. And she's not the only one, Danny. 
Tojo, thank you for the gift, and I appreciate it. Time you learn about resolver, Danny. When I was six, I rigged my first bike with a chainsaw motor. The blockade means I have to resolver every day, Juan. Nah, that's survival. For a guerrilla, resolver isn't just making do with what you have. It's inflicting chaos with everything you got. Keep talking. A guerrilla's best weapon is the workbench. There we go. Go ahead, Danny. Get cozy with it. Let's take a crack at those weapons. No offense, but your battle rifle is a little basic. Let's fix that. What do you mean, bro? Rule number nine. Always use the right tool for the right job. In this case, it's gunpowder and scraps. Sometimes I lie awake at night asking myself, Juan, how can you kill people faster? The answer is soft target rounds. Okay. But a little bit of gunpowder. Excellent, Danny. Now you can pop enemy flesh like a ripe watermelon. Okay, let's look at your other rifle. Let's say your target remembered to wear their helmet and vest today. You're gonna need some armor piercing rounds. These rounds fly straight and through and go through Kevlar like shit through a goose. Okay. Nice. Now you got your own supply of high velocity war crimes. Let's look at your attachments. Time to make your very first suppressor. This will turn a bang into a bang at the cost of some range. Okay. See how easy that was? It's now a pretty you can dope suppressor. headshot your enemies like a real asshole. The workbench is your friend, Danny. A friend with benefits. Damn, making shit is addictive. With that workbench, you can build a new yada. I wonder if, uh... So what do we need for... Yeah, yeah, this is what we need. We need to get some, like, uh, some optics. So this is, a uh, ACOG site, four times mid-range. So we just need a bit more gunpowder, and we'll be able to get this, this site done up. Okay, so resolver weapons to improve steel materials, military, hunt animals, and trade uh, meat for materials. Got it. Feel like taking Wapo for a walk? I feel like going out and looting. That's that's for sure. Ooh, so we just got the mun another piece of clothing. That was the munitions jersey. Slightly improved soft target, blast, and armor piercing defense. Okay. So we can head back down towards that military checkpoint. Oh, we got a Libertad crate. You better be here to help us. Oh crap, how the hell did we get up there? To me. I think we start up this way somewhere. Oh, grap oh, yeah, the grapple, the grapple. Well, I've seen it right I there. 
Yeah, right here. What time am I playing GT? I mean, I don't know the exact time. It will be the second stream of today, so probably around 6, 7 o'clock at night-ish. Uh, we're playing on, uh, I forgot what difficulty we're playing on. What's it? What was the name of it, chat? It's the middle one. It's not the hardest one. It's the middle one. But if the game's too easy, I'll, I always bump it up if, if it's way too easy. We got a suppressor on this rifle now. Ooh, we got a horse here. Hola. Hey. Who's there? Relax, lady. All right, let's go see what his mission is really quick before I start just venturing off. Uh, we'll get a mission and, and we'll venture at the same time. Another work, you know, a lot of workbenches around here. Get the mission. Guapo downed? What? Hola, guerrilla. You want? Danny, I've got big plans for you. But first, I need you to get a thing for me. Now, I hear you ask, Juan, what is this thing you need? All you need to know is don't try to eat it, talk to it, or put it in your pants. But one, I hear you ask, where is this thing you need? Head for the radio tower and follow the trail north. It'll take you to an abandoned camp on the east side of the island. I can mark it on your map. You'll meet my contact there. She'll hook you up. And Danny, you pull this off, I'm gonna give you something for pulling me from the bottle. A little gift an old friend gave me for saving his life. Not that you saved my life, just... I get the fuck out of here. Easy as smoking a cigar on Sunday. That's all good, man. Can I, like, get him back up? Oh, now I'm stuck, like Chuck. Really, alligator? See what you did to me, bro? I didn't kill Guapo! Now I'm freaking stuck! <laughs> there we go. What? Guapo killed himself, chat. I don't want to hear it. All right, so we got to follow, uh, we, damn, that's quite a far freaking journey. We can follow these, uh, these trails here. Uh, out the back side of the camp. Stay positive, guerrilla. Try to win this. There we go. Okay, so gunpowder is one of the crafting resources we need, so we're going to keep our eyes open for that. I don't know if you can only get gunpowder from the military drops, or if it's something that we can kind of just loot out and about, you know what I mean?
Okay, so we'll take a left here. Oh, you can loot it everywhere? Okay, awesome. Oh, look, they got the little zip lines and shit set up at the gorilla, gorilla Pass. the tower. So traveling these paths, they said, um, keeps us safe from, like, the military and stuff. The bow? Do they have a bow and arrow in this game? Yo, that'd be cool. Grab a horse? Yeah, I should have gra grabbed one before, but the issue is you can't... You won't be able to do the zip lining if I had a horse. So I'll try to grab one at the end of my... trail here. You don't got any loot? There it is. Bless you. Oh, there was a chest over here. I didn't even grab. Is Far Cry worth getting? I would definitely say if you like open world games, for sure. This is a pop. Here we go. Awesome. So all these crates keep giving us like uh, armor pieces. We almost got the full munition set. Munitions, munitions. I think the only thing we need is maybe headgear. And then I think we get a set bonus. So how do I heal? Uh, B? No. Oh, I'm auto healing. Never mind. Damn, I took a lot of damage from that fall. So, unfortunately, no horse at the end of the trail here. But we can follow this trail the rest of the way. Now, it does look like. Oh, there's a horse right up there on the main road. I've been through enough of them in Esperanza. Clear the checkpoints, destroy the billboards, then watch Libertad rise from the ashes. Oh, did it get loud? That horse got set on fire. Good. 
Come on, horse. Back up. That horse ain't about to fit into the trail there. Fine. Let's go! Go around, right? You know, I could probably actually just follow the road. Anderson with the upgraded membership, brother. Thank you so much, man. I really appreciate that. Uh, silencers overheat and get less effective until they cool off. Slow! I appreciate it, Anderson. Thank you, man. All right, cool. Yeah, we'll follow this trail up here. We're good. So we got the checkpoints over there. Found the tower. Don't stop now, Danny. Find the guerrilla path and follow it to my contact. See, si. I'm on my way. Oh, hold on, hold on. we got it. There's a chest here, bro. We got to get the chest. Got the munitions bracelet. <laughs> so we actually almost have the full set. So I'll take it the, um, this horse icon here, where you can spawn horses. Reading a horse since basic training. Easy. There it is. So now we got the actual full set. Now the thing is, is I don't want to. The headset helmet looks a little, a little funky. So what do we get for the full set bonus? Does it tell you? I don't think it. Yeah, it doesn't say. But we have the full munition set now. Come on. Let's go link up with the contact. Oh, oh, so Whoa. I don't get the bonus until I have the full set. Got you, got you. Chest up here, too. Here comes trouble. Relax, lady. I'm... Yeah, I, I mean, I would toggle the helmet off if it was like third person game, but it's first person, so I can't see it anyways, you know what I mean? Whoa. 
The Aluas must be watching me. You're in the right place, Danny. Well, look, lady, I'm looking for gunpowder, so... My name is Raisa, and I'm going to be helping you steal shit from Castillo today. Are you going to tell me what I'm stealing? Depleted uranium. <laughs> Pardon. I thought you just said uranium. You heard me. Look, all I know is I burned my last contact in the army tracking it down for Juan. You ex-military? Isn't everybody? Okay. Just show me where it is. First, you take this parachute. Trust me, it can save your life. Now I'll take you to the old Spanish fort. They've got it locked up inside. How about you hook me up more on the May case? I don't mind the fail, but... But the AK would definitely put in a bit more work. Conscript or volunteer? Conscript. My number came up, so I did my time. You? Volunteer. All I wanted to be was a soldier. You know, wear the uniform, serve my country. Found out the only kind of soldier Castillo wants is a blind fascist addicted to his every word. So now you're a traitor. Yeah, and I'm not the only one. There's a guard posted at the watchtower ahead. He's going to let us use it to scout out the fort. He can also give us useful info. What does he want from us? One, not to get his ass shot. So keep your gun holstered or he'll open fire. Two, a little bribe to these double agents will get us military intel. Right. No weapons. Pesos ready. Okay, so bribing double agents. Some soldiers are FND double agents and have uh, valuable intel. Also your weapons before approaching them. Bribe with uh, pesos. Okay, too easy. There he is. Hope you got some pesos on you. Oh, well, it's not that expensive. What do you got for me? Okay, check this out. Here's where you can find some weapons around here. Thanks a lot. Sure. Whatever you and Raisa are about to do, I don't want to be around for it. Everyone's got their price. Not every soldier's a fanatic. Some are just trying to feed their families. Just remember to put the guns away before you approach them. I thought it was, I'm just checking for some loot real quick, guys, before we head out. Oh, I gotta come up here anyways, don't I? For the mission. Use your phone to scout up enemy soldiers and see their weaknesses. I bet Juan's already giving you his right tool for the right job, Doc. What about the gunpowder, though, lady? Okay, so use your phone. Scout. Okay, so yeah, this is a scouting just like in the other Far Cry games. Yeah, still not being able to find gunpowder. Gunpowder. I'll take it. Gunpowder is probably like the uh, the the rarer resource, at least right now, early game. Hola. Okay, so they have uh, armor, armor on armor. Damn, these dudes are thick. There's the officer in charge. Alvarez has the key to the armory. Careful, Danny. He's higher rank. In Castillo's army, that means he's better trained, quicker with the trigger, and a tough motherfucker. Is that all the... That's all the baddies I could see. Is that a mortar? Do I need a full-fledged, like, actual sniper rifle? This fort is the most protected base on the island. These soldiers have been issued with body armor and helmets. Nothing armor piercing rounds can't handle. Use the workbench if you need to craft some, and then go snatch that uranium, Danny. That parachute I gave you could come in handy here. Just don't drop into the middle of the fort, okay? Howdy. Uh, so while you're falling, press spacebar to deploy the parachute. Got it. And guys, I want to thank you guys. We almost got 500 likes on the stream. That is huge. There we go. 
Okay. Careful, Danny. Oye, show yourself. Well, that person heard me running. Army gal, thank you so much for the gift. Did I appreciate it? I'd be able to get up on that side right there. I mean, there's a ladder right there we can go, but I wanted to get up behind this guy and start working my way through the fort that way. Oh, well, you know what? We might, have a, we might be able to get this dude right here up top. Commander. Join me in thanking the brave men and women of the Yara This should get me Juan's uranium. Got it. I give our soldiers the best training and place only the best weapons in their hands. All for your protection. When they swear so the melee kills are freaking OP. They become warriors. When you see a soldier of Yara, it is the duty of their protection to stop them. And thank them for the mortars down. I think if this is their alarm system here, I could probably disable that. There's another guy down, down bottom that we missed. Disable the alarm. I think he's the only one down here. My true Yaras, learn these names. Clara Garcia. Found the armory. The uranium is inside. These are our enemies. They are not people. <laughs> Have any information leading to their whereabouts. Paradise 
will be ours. But only after these terroristas have been brought to justice. Let's take this another stealthy way in. Let's go uh, drop the alarm, hit the armory here. Ooh. Do you see they got a camera? I'm pretty sure that shit. There it is, too easy. Gunpowder. Whoa, nice. We got an actual sniper rifle now. My thing is, if I crafted this suppressor, can you, like, remove it? Or is it, and, like, put it on another gun? Or is, like, when you make it, you make it for the gun you make it for? Like, you have to... I, I, I don't know if like I could, or you could take it off. And uh, does anybody know? We just got a, a full fledged sniper. Look at that. The uranium. What? You didn't fucking tell me I was stealing uranium. It was supposed to be a surprise. Now bring it back to me. Wait, didn't what they... if this shit kills me? It's depleted uranium, Danny. Stop being such a pussy. When the Libertad terroristas attack one of our tobacco fields, they are attacking all of us. They are attacking Yara. Each gun has its own mod of kit. Got you. Damn, if I would've known that, I would've... Let's see. Oh, there's an underwater dock here. I need to get in there, Chess. Looks like there's like a gun case or something. It says this is locked. What if there's something special we have to do to open it? I wonder if it's up top somewhere. They even look, uh, generally with stuff like that, you can follow like electric cables or something in, in some games. I didn't see any power going to the door. Okay, so you can break it. The autocraft pistol. Oh, so you can carry three primaries. Okay, that's dope. Improve aim, improve body shot damage with weapon, and it has the the armor piercing rounds. Uh, guys, again, I want to thank you. We got over 500 likes. You guys are amazing. Seriously, thank you so much.
pretty much clear out this whole. I wonder if you if I kill everybody, if it like triggers like the like oh you cleared the outpost type of thing. And I don't I don't know if like people can come and like claim it. We have not been getting any gunpowder for the most part. Got a charm there. So the melee just absolutely shreds. Wish I had one of those horse locations around here. We got a horse spawn over here. So I think I actually might make my way up to that. Uh, did I see the Marvel movie Guardian of the Galaxy 3? No, I, I don't know. I, I watched, um, back when, uh, all the Avengers movies and stuff, I, I, I watched them all, like, in order. But I don't know if that one was out back when I watched them. Yeah, I went in the basement. We got this uh, rare handgun. Only thing, thing, I don't know if you can suppress it. We got to get a suppressor on it, maybe. Ever going to play the Just Cause games? Yeah, we're going to try them out at some point. I think uh, I was gifted, uh, I think, Just Cause 2. Let me see. Yep, okay, you can. So that's why I was wondering if you could spawn horses from here. Danny, you got the uranium? See. Si. Still want to know what he's going to do with it. If I know Juan, you're about to get a fucked up surprise. See you back at camp. I'm hoping I can... Uh, unique weapons can't be customized. Got you. Okay. This is quite good. Yeah, in and out, chat. Not a shot fired. Not a shot fired. What did he do? Did he hit his face on some, or was it just dry air? Yeah, I would love to get a bow and arrow. You guys know me. I love... I I love stealth. I love silent weapons. Easy now. Oh, he got hit.
Yeah, so this is the trail into the base right here. Reminds me a lot of like um Wildlands. Just like a like the like I don't know, like the, the way the map is set up is it's a, kind of like a first person wildlands. Easy. Resolver, Danny. Depleted uranium. Soviets left these sexy byproducts of nuclear enrichment behind in the 80s. Yankees use it for tank armor and bullets. <laughs> Crazy assholes. Sounds dangerous. You'll be a fucking superhero, Danny. Nita and I used to sneak these into the orphanage. Essential reading while waiting to fuck up convoys in the mud. A guerrilla must be a sponge for inspiration. Okay. But what the hell is this? This is a Supremo. Supremo. Looks like a rocket launcher. See? She does that too. One more thing. I want you to meet Tostador. The two go together like fire and fury. I like how you reserve her, Juan. So do I. Dudes over here making hey, hola. You're new all the here. goods. Supreme. Okay, so let's see. What do we have now? We got a flamethrower. We got a sniper rifle. We got a regular rifle. And we got a handgun. Okay. Those are like a good lover. Or a great sandwich. Are you just hungry, Juan? Yes. But I'm talking about layers, Danny. Head to the workbench and I'll show you. Supremos aren't just simple. Let's take a look at that Supremo. Okay, so Armageddon Strike launch a series of rockets uh, that lock on enemies and explode on impact. So it's like a portable mortar launcher on my back. The special ingredient that makes this all happen is Supremo Bond. You need it to make your gadgets. Pick a gadget, Danny. This is a safe space. There's no wrong answer here. Uh, grenades, dynamite, reception, smoke, throwing knives. Excellent. Now go talk to Clara. Time to give that Supremo a workout. Got nothing to say to you. What? Now go talk to Clara. Time to put that Supremo to use, guerrilla. Okay, so hold Q, weapon, select gadgets, got it. Um, throw with that, got it. Hola. Stay strong. And we got the watch. I wonder if that's better than the... Uh, greatly improves general defense while sprinting. This one acquire additional sidearm ammo. We need to talk. Let's do it. I don't need to tell you that Viviro is the lifeblood of Castillo's regime. He's built work camps to produce it all over Yara. These plantations use outcasts as slaves to grow the tobacco plants they turn into Viviro. These are our people, Danny. Beaten, tortured, sprayed by poison chemicals. There's a camp on this island. We tried to destroy it when we invaded. We failed. Now we're going to finish the job. Julio is waiting for you at a nearby barn. Alright. 100 XP doesn't seem like a whole lot. Alright, let's see. So we gotta head, our, head down this way. Yeah, I, wanted, I, I thought that the throwing knives would be a good... Uh, 
combination with my my play style. before I strap one to my back. Just let that Supremo feed off the blood of your enemies. What? <laughs> You'll get it, Danny. <laughs> You'll get it. Uh, hey, hey. What? Yo, these rubble pats are legit. Probably actually drop down here. So I don't think this is the enemy camp. I think this is just where we're linking up with. Yeah. This is just where we're linking up with Julio. And there's a crate in here that we're going to get. Parkour camp. Yo, that just looks dope. So, improves maximum stamina. Okay. I, like, I, I do like the gear system. Each piece of gear has, like, its own little specialties, so... Uh, you can definitely kit out, she, depending you on your play style. Up. Listen, I'm not going to bullshit you. I wanted to do this alone, but Clara gave me an order. I can handle myself. Don't give a shit. So could Lita. She should be here right now, but instead, I get you. And I'm supposed to be in Miami. But instead, my two best friends are dead, and I'm stuck here with you. So, truce? Enough talk. Step one, we hit the tobacco. Step two, we destroy their poison supply. Step three, we get the fuck out of there, and Castillo gets a nice pretty message from Libertad. Got it. Take this gear. He'll protect you from fire, and more importantly, Castillo's fucking poison. Fuego mitts. Get a lot of... Uh, so when on fire, the flames are automatically put out. Ooh, that'll probably be useful if I'm over here burning, uh... <laughs> Burning stuff, but we'll wait and see if I have to use the, uh... And then we got the hazmat mask. What is that? What if that does it? Uh, protects your eyes from poison. Using the right protective gear in the right situation will keep you alive. Yeah. The right tool for the right job. Oh shit, that's pretty cool though, the being able to swap alone, out helmets to help with certain things. Yeah, that, that's... I like that. Listen, Julio. Lita was like a sister to me. She shouldn't have been on that fucking boat. She died because of you, Rojas. No. Anton Castillo killed Lita. If I could change anything, it would be me dying on that beach. Lita was a better person than I could ever be. And if she loved you, well, that just says a lot about who you are. Enough. Look, if you and I are going to do this, you need to know about the poison. You mean that shit they spray on the leaves? Its real name is PG-240, but we call it the poison because it fucks up your system. Try not to breathe it or get it on your skin. It can make you go fucking crazy or sick, like deep down sick. And if that doesn't get you, the cancer that grows inside you will. Gone, yo. So you're military. Marksman? Close assault? What's your thing? I'm good with guns. We get along. We'll start thinking. That gear I gave you is good for fire and poison, but guerrillas need gear that fits their style, no matter the situation, or they get themselves killed. This is a good place to scout it. Right behind you. 
Let's see what we're up against. James, thank you for the super chat. Uh, happy Mother's Day to Mama Menard. Hey, we appreciate the love. Let me see. I don't think I got any gunpowder yet, if I'm being honest. Fight on this one. Yeah, it's still no gunpowder, man. I want to get a suppressor for this gun. It'd be so nice. How many different guns? Are there quite a few guns in this game? Up here, Dali. See the reveal of tobacco and the yellow poison tanks. See. Punch holes in the tanks to let the poison out into the air. Fun fact. Poison and fire make a hell of a mix. Big boom. Same idea with the fumigators. They're hard to kill, but they can't take the heat. You've got a flamethrower. You've got that Supremo. Time to fuck up all this Vaviro bullshit. You know... Lita and I had a ritual. Psych us up before battle. A song. Hit me. El movimiento de libertad. Oh, bella ciao, bella ciao. Bella ciao, ciao, ciao. <laughs> For Lita. For Lita. Let's make some chaos, Danny. No, dude, we're gonna do this the smart way, brother. Don't be an idiot. Shit, a fumigator. Okay, so these guys are weak against fire. But it seems like everybody's weak against melee, right? Okay, I can destroy it. What we could do is we could kill everybody. Residents of Santuario Island, there is a viper in your midst. The terrorist Nevada Garcia, the self proclaimed leader of the Granada, is trapped on your island territory. If you see her, or anything is done with the terrorist, inform the first military officer you see, or your local protectorate. <laughs> To the ground. Look around. So good. So they're all ganging up over here. I think he's, he didn't see me. There's no way he's seen me. He must have seen the other dude. Which is quite annoying, but it is what it is.
everywhere over here now. So they're spreading back out. We don't have to worry about it. I wonder how strong the throwing knives are. Find him! He's not far. They spread back out. The throwing knives are absolutely insane. I bet you see me. Hey. We got bodies over here. So we need to the 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 responsible. Get that dog, though. It's going to mess everything up. I can tell. I know they're still here. I can feel it. What? The Supremo is fucking perfect. See, and don't forget. If she needs a recharge, the Supremo loves it when you kill more soldados. She's fun like that. Relax, dude. Relax, relax. Gotcha. You're good to go. Keep on them! Should have done a little bit more shooting instead of uh Fuck that shit. only melee. But alright, here we go. Yeah, we definitely need to get those fucking gloves on, man. Ouch. And everything without having to worry about the enemies. Where I hear music. Damn, that was that was pretty dope. I did not expect her to kick me down to the ground like that.
So we only burned 25% of this whole thing. Okay, yeah, the whole thing burned. Awesome. That one's burning over there. Or on this field here. To be honest, flamethrowers are generally one of my least used weapons in games. Like, there's plenty of games that introduce flamethrowers to you as weapons, and I, I never freaking use it. Like, ever. So we gotta blow these tanks, too, right? I think once we do this, and we hit it with a little bit of flame, it'll blow up. Gotcha! That was perfect. Suck, okay. man. You really suck. I mean, granted, a shotgun guy did just run up on him, but still. Uh, military target. All right, so we got some more yellow tanks, I believe, on this side that we got to destroy. And these fields. Got to destroy more shit! I don't, I don't know if it's going to spread over to this field. Field, and then we're looking for another set of tanks. Of 
as the other tanks. That was a good hit with that armor piercing. On my way. Right there it is. But we didn't burn every field, but I guess it didn't require me to. We just had to burn a certain amount. What is that? USB stick. Feels that there's a, uh, a loot crate. It looks like it's up on the roof, maybe? Yep, here we go. Nice! Freaking gunpowder. That shit's so hard to find, man. So I'll take it if you're hitting them big crates that or the the crates around the map, that's where you get the gunpowder from. Potentially. Yeah, it's not a super common crafting resource. Hmm. Burning sheet with a flamethrower. Felt familiar. Is that a call back to Far Cry 3? I bet they see the smoke from Esperanza. Shit. You really can hold your own. FNC crates have it. Got so, you. But... Look, we should move. That was a hell of a light show, and they're going to see the smoke. We work well together. See? Si. Listen, if you are good with Lita, you're good with me. Gracias, Danny. Meet you back at camp. My favorite... Uh, I mean, my two favorite Assassin's Creed games of all time were... Um, Odyssey and Valhalla and uh, Black Flag too. Black Flag, Odyssey, Valhalla. Origins was awesome. Too. I don't know. There's so many of them that were good. Okay, so we just got um, intel also on a couple locations that we could. Oh, you could fast travel? Let's go clear out this checkpoint. I don't, I don't know if it will unlock a fast travel point. And then this too is a um, FND base. Let's see what happens if we capture the checkpoints. If it maybe. Unlocks like a trap fast travel point. They do unlock. Okay, cool. And it's a F, uh, and we might be able to find some more gunpowder there. Oh yeah, Clara. I hope you can see the smoke from where you are. You struck a blow against Castillo today. I hope Julio wasn't too rough on you. He's hurting, but okay. I think Lita would be smiling right now. Danny, there's someone I want you to meet. His name is Benito. He's a local fisherman. Which means votes for Libertad. He lives on the east side of Casas Cove. Always got time to make new friends. You're building bridges for me, Danny. It's your gift. We need Benito. Talk to him. Hey, you. Gracias. De nada. Uh, four new Libertad crates revealed. Awesome. So you can, like, find little intels around the, the world. And obviously, you've seen that guy there. We, we freed him, and I got more intel. 
It's a good looking game though, man. I only got one gunpowder right now, so I can't even do a real scope. I could, I, I could do a, uh, I could do a suppressor on my sniper rifle, but the sniper rifle scope, it's decent, but it's not like super, super oh, zoom. Better be careful. Sniper's heading up top. Should kill the alarm. Made that shit sound real bad. Yeah, I don't know how to command the alligator, but I think if I do, it will it will uh, make the camp go aggro. Bet this place has a stash room. Got to be careful here. Coming back up. Two of them at the same time on opposite sides of the island. Someone's talking with you. And do you have any idea how many ones were best sightings you get? Well, that sounds like my own father. What? Oh, they have a, a mine there. Should be the whole camp. I was, there might be another person, but uh, Neil's reinforcements. Just gotta cash. Whoa, nice. Just got an SMG. Seven hundred rounds a minute. That's no joke. How do we claim the place? What do I gotta do? Oh, you destroy the billboard? That's it? Can I destroy it with a molly? Perfect. <laughs> the weapons are here, well, but one arm dealer. The checkpoint is clear. Okay, so overcoming the regime. Capture military targets, destroy, uh, instill military supplies and resources. Yep. Didn't that feel good? You've earned some guerrilla karma today. Keep it up, Danny. All right, awesome. So there is a big military base over here, the fuel depot. Uh, we found intel for this in that last base we're at, so I think I might... Go hit this location. We got a horse. Some horses right here. You. Yeah, you. What is this? 
stack point key for what? Huh? Soldado checkpoint key. What? What's the key for? I don't see any lock spots in the checkpoint, though. Hola, que vuelta. Not much to the damn check. Oh, I already unlocked. Oh, okay, so that key was for that door. How the hell did I unlock the door then? Tell me what you know. You want to hit the military where it hurts? There's an anti-aircraft site on Santuario. Blow it up. Thanks a million. Okay, nice. Yeah, so you can get intel on all these different military locations. Grab a, let's grab a horsey. Where you at, horses? Kurt. Be nice, horse. Thank you for the six months. And George, uh, thank you for the super chat, man. Uh, two hours and 660 likes so far. I'm, I'm having a blast. Yeah, I'm definitely having a blast with this. It's a little more open-ended than five. Danny, my scouts tell me you're close to the fuel depot. It's an F&D base now. Give me me to take it. Definitely See, enjoying it. The army has bases all over Yara. We want freedom. We need to break their grip on the island. I'll do what I can, Clara. Okay, so is the goal for this place to just kill everybody, or is it... Hey, hey, you help me, please. They are the traitors. They deserve this and everything that is coming to them. Please, muchas gracias. No hay problem. Help me. That dude's a savage. Just killed the prisoner, man. It wasn't my fault, Chad. It had nothing to do with that. Anderson, thank you for the super chat, man. You can destroy billboards with your repair torch. Oh, does it set them on fire? Probably actually be cheaper than uh, using Molotovs, honestly. Clara, I'm at the depot. Libertad needs that fuel. So taking that depot isn't just about dealing with the army. It also means securing that gasoline. You've got to do this smart, Danny. Find some high ground and use your phone to scout out cameras and alarms. Yeah, yeah, I got you. Sniper up top there. I wish I had a freaking so uh, scope. Might be able to hit the shot from here. Andate. Because you're going to... Damn it. I was hoping he would stay up top. 
This valve will help drain the oil and prevent an explosion. I bet this place has a stash room. Around here, I'll get, be able to get eyes on. Doesn't seem like there's a whole lot of enemies in here, so it shouldn't be too bad to clear this place out. Kill them down there. well enough what am I playing at we'll be doing GTA 5 later on tonight guys thank you we got almost 700 likes on the show it's humongous no alarm sounded bonus resources secured is any of the bonus resources gunpowder right, let's do some looting here over here, my friend. What's up? We found a sacred site dedicated to Triada. There's treasure in there, but it's guarded by spirits. I don't want any part of that shit. I wish you luck, compai. Thanks. Go around, see if you can find... Ah, uh, here, here's the stash room. RPD, so we got an LMG. LMGs really aren't my thing. Um, even though the one game, I do give Far Cry credit. Uh, it's one of the only games that's ever actually made me feel like I could use an LMG. Like certain missions or situations, I'd, like especially Far Cry 3, I was using an LMG all the time. Uh, but yeah, LMGs are generally not weapons I, I, I resort to all that often. We already got into the storage room. Okay, so this is a vehicle spawn location. Oh shit, look at that. I can I can call this car. Awesome. And you can change the paint. Oh look at that. Yo, how many cars are in the game? lot holy crap there's a bit see some tanks over there Let's go check out this uh, it looked like there was a yeah merchant over here like a store oh so trade wild hog meat Durable seal. <laughs> so maybe we need to go do some more hunting too, chat. We can get uh, and then we can trade all this stuff for pesos. 
So it can be found uh, used to build and upgrade camp facilities at the construction desk. Okay, that, that sounds like something I don't even have access to yet. So I'm not going to get rid of any of these resources because I'm pretty sure we're going to probably need them for something later on in the game. And then purchase. Why? Ooh, look at that M9. Scorpion, shotgun, AK-47. We don't have enough money for it. Got some... Think about grabbing this M9, but I haven't really been using my gun, my handguns all that much, so. Hilo, shit. Need something? Let me see. So, so right now this is our primary that we have here. I could get an optic for this now because I got a gunpowder, but do I really want to do that, or should I? We optic the sniper, or should we suppress the sniper? Oh, the American sniper is actually really, the suppressor is really good. It maintains a lot of its uh, velocity. So why would you go for any other, oh, it's, so these two are, why would you ever go for the Russian one if the American one's the same price and just better? Oh, so these overheat really fast though. Well, they all overheat. This very quick, very quick, or quite quick. This is very quick. Okay, so I think the uh, American suppressor overheats faster. Got it. Um, and this one, uh, it doesn't overheat as quick. But the American one, like I said, on the sniper rifle, I don't think it really matters. You know what I mean? We'll, we'll Yeah, we'll throw this on here. And we'll be able to do a little bit of work. I would like to get freaking armor piercing rounds, but we got to find more gunpowder. So. Right, let's head out. Oh, there's a gun crate down here. So, yeah, we got the intel and it showed us, shows you where some gun crates and stuff are. Wait, I seen a fishing pole. You could fish in this game? It was tied to a mission, I think. Where did I just see that? Yeah, right there. It's horrible. It was pretty good in five. It's not as good as it was in five. Well, watch out, horsies. Absolutely despise first-person driving. At least they make the windshields nice and open, so... Found a fishing spot right here. Thank you. You got it. Build more crates. Let's go find out what's in this gun crate. Is the stealth decent in this game? Oh, yeah, it's awesome. So far, I've been able to play fully my way stealth, uh, throwing knives. I, and I, there's people are saying there's a bow and arrow in the game, so. Our new baby right here. I hate this scope. Need to get a real ACOG, man. But it's okay. It's not... Well, not just. Because, like I said, we're shooting this out of a 
bolt action rifle. We don't really have to worry too much about the overheating factor. There it is. It is. Bring them up. Now somebody said something about. Oh, so if if you if you bring a vehicle back to the the vehicle spawn locations, you get access to that vehicle. Is that how you grow your your car collection? Okay, cool. Got my snag this Jeep then. Dolly. How the hell do I get up here? Grapple. Another grapple point out here. Water's gorgeous. As long as there's no sharks in it, you know. You know me, guys. I like the water as long as there's no nothing in it. I don't know if I'm. I swear I saw a silhouette. You guys know how my brain is, though. I play over here trying to play tricks on me. There yeah, was the wave. The wave went like a certain way. It looked like an outline of a shark, though. Oh, here we go. It's got a unique shotgun. Oh, that thing's wicked nice. The fast way down. Oh, yeah, we got the uh, parachute, right? <laughs> yep, perfect. Bring this back up to our outpost right up the road. Okay, so is that all you got to do? I don't have to, like, access anything? Or you just pull it into the spot and voila? This guy's got more intel for us, too. Hey! Here! What's up? What do you got? There's a giant hog that swam all the way from Anton's fucking zoo on the island. Kill it, guerrilla. Help these people. Gracias, gracias. Legendary animal? Okay, so we can, uh... We got a main mission over here, which gives us access to the, the fishing pole that's fuel the revolution. Um, oh, I never went in that cave either. Uh, 
Oh yeah, up here. There's that legendary Hunt Mamudo trade its tusk for unique gear at the gorilla camp. Yeah, it's like a legendary. 96 for your shoes. That's not bad. Pretty dope. Good good thing it wasn't yourself. Trying to buy the shoes off of yourself, right? You'd be disrespectful sometimes with it. That, guys, Crystal's like the master buyer of things, right? Like, I tell her all the time, like, someone would be selling something online, right? It'd be like, some, like, thrift, like, I don't know, a pair of shoes or something. They'll be older shoes, right? And the person would literally be selling them online for, like, $10. Legit, guys, $10. And she'll be like, yo, will you take five? I'm like... Bro, it's only 10 bucks. Like, how are you going to disrespect them people like that? Or, you know, she's like, or it should be, hey, it's $5. And they'll be like, she'll be like, yo, you'll take three. <laughs> I'm like, really? It's only five bucks. Like, just grab it. That should be funny sometimes. All right, so we'll take the main road down. We'll cut up here to this main mission. Let's go. Ah, you're okay. Well, she does a good job because the people really agree to that. Like, they really do. They really are like, hey, I, I, you know, I'll take it. But my thing is, it's like, if I'm selling something and, and somebody swindles me down to three bucks, oh, no. I, at that point, I'm just going to fucking give it to you, bro. Like, <laughs> you just have it at that point. <laughs> Yeah, it's not no hostiles. Yeah. Easy now. Easy. Whoa. So one thing I do like about the Far Cry games is uh you guys know I like I like survival scavenging type games and stuff. So there we go. Um, this game gets you looting, you know, and I, I, I love looting. I love looting. Play the line and the cup, but the looting only feels good when the like it actually matters. Because some of the Far Cry games, you don't even need to loot once you hit a certain part of the game. You're just like, you just have everything. I'm exhausted. I can tell you right now, Hold though, on. that the price it is or the, how hard it is to get gunpowder. Definitely gonna be grinding that shit out. <laughs> oh, hey, holy shark today! That means there's Every sharks on the game. <laughs> Let me guess. Clara Garcia talked you into this. She even had us fishers hooked on her Libertad nonsense. Convinced us to help her little invasion of Santuario. Lost five of my best. Now Clara calls me begging for boats. More recruits. Pfft. I'm a pirate first. Fisher second. Thank the blockade for that. We use our boats to pull fish from the sea. And we get people and contraband past the army. But El Presidente died in his grip. The new Comandante, Rosario, has locked down all the fuel to keep it out of Libertad's hands. Murders anyone who dares get near it. I heard you liberated the refueling station. Gracias. But if Clara wants us to help Libertad, kill Rosario and show the army we won't go down without a fight. Okay. Suerte, compay. Okay, so this is across the cove here. 
Yeah, we'll just take the main road, I guess. Honey, the what only thing better than a guerrilla is a guerrilla with a nice ride. You want me to steal one? Been doing that since I was a kid. You're in the big leagues now. You need a car? Just call for one. I'll have a friend bring it right to you. Gracias. But you don't have any friends, Juan. Just shut up and call for a car, Danny. Easy now. Well, we got the repair tool. So what does he mean by call for a car on this thing? Oh, right there. Follow me. Vamos. What's wrong with the freaking horse, man? Call your ride. Let's ride. Oh, there it is. Oh, this thing's pretty sweet. Oh, and... You have to walk, Wapo. Juan, was it me, dude? Nice car. That's not a car, Danny. That is a 1956 Beaumont Valentina. Nice, and we got a mod who's up top. Just like me, except I don't have a ram welded to my chassis to fuck up anyone who gets in your way. You're definitely one of a kind. <laughs> now go get those fascists, Tiger. Roads are not very wide. Well, this one's way faster than the one we were driving earlier. That. Shit, what's the best way to get into there? Looks like there might be a path here. We can take that's a gorilla path. Uh, I think we were probably supposed to cut off the main road back here. But that was that tunnel, wasn't it? The one that I said I wanted to go through? Yep, that was it. The famous young people. We just have to burn, burn through the base there. Okay, well, we gotta chill, we gotta chill. This whole area is restricted. This whole front here. Yeah, taking care of a Comandante problem for Benito. Watch yourself. The military in Bensejo is much stronger, better equipped, and better trained. Find some high ground, do some scouting before you pull the trigger. Remember, rule number nine, right tool for the right job. Rule number ten, shut the fuck up. You're an adult and can make your own decisions. Spread your wings and fly, little bird. Oh, let's get into position. If shit hits the fan, we do got a 50 cal, so. I should keep an eye out for Rosario. That must be Rosario. 
Oh shit, there's a whole tank over there. Okay, so we don't want that to go active. That would be really, really shitty. Look, man, there was a gorilla path we could have freaking took and had the high ground over the camp. Came in right through the backside. I'm thinking I might be able to get up on this rock face here, maybe, if, it, if it's not too steep. I'm down on the top here and, and take that guy out. Get my hands on the tank. Awesome, we can. I was going to snipe him, but I was worried that he would fall over the railing. And then it would aggro everybody up. Body literally fell. Okay, now she's hanging. She's hanging. I'm cool with it. We're still, we're still in there, chat. Oh, the damn crocodile, man. Wapo, move. Always fucking shit up. How do you just... Is there a way to disable him? He's so annoying. That guy's got some armor on him. Takes care of Rosario. Adios. That's what. Right up top. No escaparán. Dispersense. Whoa, shit. Okay, Benito. Rosario is dead. And the fuel is flowing again. Si, sí, carajo. I admit, I got my doubt about Clara. But I never doubted you, compai. I know a thing or two about looking out for your own. Tell Clara I'm heading to her camp. She's got our boats and our support. Gracias, Danny. We should get the multi-take down. We got the fishing pole. Wait. It was that that I had to go down the road and do something else. Clara, Benito's back on your side. He's on his way to you right now. Shit, Danny, gracias. Now get your ass back to camp. It's time to get off this island. Just remember our deal. I've paid my rent in name so. One of those boats has me sailing to Miami. I keep my word, Danny. How about We're trouble, guys. history first? I blew up the fucking tank I wanted. <gasps> Guapo, you're such an idiot, man. This fucking tank is the real deal, man.
I, I, I freaking blew up this one. Be able to find any any boom in here, chat. Nothing to make this mess with a tank. Nice, got some more gunpowder though. Okay, so it doesn't know exactly where I am right now. I don't think I'm going to be able to get into my car. There's no way. Jump on the tank, pull out the crew. Granted, it can't hurt me when I'm on top of it, but... <laughs> There's no way in. Yeah, I was in a bad spot, guys. That tank just... Right there. Use the fishing pole. <laughs> kind of sucks that we lost uh, the tank that was here, though. I did really want that. I need a ride. Yeah, I, I see. I seen I could hit the gas tank on the uh, the gas tank on the it tank, is, uh, but it didn't seem like it did a whole lot. Sorry, Guapo. No crocs allowed. This thing's got some speed to it, man. Oh, that tank's right back there. These uh, arrows and shit aren't very, like, sneaky, you know, like the markings. It's, 
If I was one of the military guys, I'd, I'd instantly see the arrows and stuff. But oh, I wonder what's down here. So you can't zip up. Wait, can you? Uh, Raiden next. Thank you so much for the three months. How you doing tonight? Or today? It's still pretty early afternoon for me. I seen people last year. Yeah, we'll be playing GTA later on tonight. There it is. Rule 73. Wow, there's that many rules? I thought there was like 10 or 11. You must have stealth to jack the tank. What's the third game? There would be no third game. You want us to take down Anton's ships? We're goddamn fishermen. Then leave us to die again, compai. What are you doing? Try it. It's fun. What's the plan, Heffa? For Anton to see us from the fucking capital? Yes. Well, it's working. You've got 20 minutes until Anton's forces come. So you better start running. Go! I said, run! Rules of the guerrilla, Juan Cortez. A revolution is not won by the fearless. Is won by the feared. What does Anton Castillo fear? Free elections, free expression, free outcasts. Ayara free of Castillos. But he will fear nothing. Unless you are willing to die for your freedom today. Not when we have more believers or more guns. Today. Because today I'm going to put a hole through Castillo's warships. I am not fearless. I am scared as hell. But I promise you one thing. I will be feared. Viva Libertad. Viva Libertad. Viva Libertad. Let's go home, Grias. Does she know what she's doing? Who cares, Danny? She knows what we need. See you from the sky, guerrilla. There it is. So do I got to clear out this stuff in order to, I don't, I don't uh, oh, maybe hold on. Somebody will contact us here in a sec. We do have another gunpowder though, so we, yep, there we go. Danny. We do have another gunpowder. I think I'm gonna save it for right now though. You copy? You get that chopper up and running. See, si, but there's an anti-aircraft cannon blocking the airspace around Castillo's warships. Okay, Juan. I'll take it out. Silvio, because if it gets me, I'll make sure my fiery corpse comes down on you like a meteor. Okay, so we gotta actually take the anti-aircraft thing out. Yep. Awesome. So we tech I wonder if you could have done that before the mission. You know, while we're up there, we should probably go hunt this damn boar too. Go see how legendary the legendary boar is. Don't worry, I'm a friend. Easy. Ezra, how you doing?
mean, why are they peeping at me? I'm literally the best driver in this freaking town. I've watched two people run somebody over. Danny, I wanted to tell you something. Hell of a speech you gave. Listen to me. Whatever happens now, I wanted to thank you. For everything you've done for Libertad and for me. Thank me once we've blasted through Castillo's blockade. See you on the other side, Danny. Hurry, hurry, go. Run, run. What the hell was that? Bad Wolf with the super team. Thank you so much. Yo, that wasn't me though. I didn't hit those. They actually ran into me. That wasn't the legendary one. Is this shotgun? Is this did the shotgun do that, or did I shoot some explosive? It was either me or you, my boy. Dude, this shotgun is actually insane. A good cocodrilo. Yeah, it's an incendiary hey, shot. Okay, okay, Juan. I'll take it out. Teamwork makes the dream work. That's my Forget saying. That's a really good gun for the uh, for animals, at least. All right, let's go knock out this anti-air gun. So I didn't run the alligator over, chat.
Damn, dude, you almost got shot, bro. Go the rest. That's a good horse. Yeah. It's a nice looking horse, man. It's a black one. I like this color. Go. My thing is, I don't really have any, like, explosives. Okay. Watch yourself, Danny. I if this, oh, we might be able to ignite that right there, that fuel. More depleted uranium. Very, very lightly guarded AA gun. It's a little out of my range with the silly scope. Go. Oh, more baddies. Juan, anti-aircraft cannons out. The sky is yours. Now go get those ships, and Juan will be your avenging angel of death. Whatever. As long as you got my back. Them dudes are the best grenade got throwers, your back, man. A fresh cigar and 12,000 rounds of divine wrath. Vamos echando! So let me get see. Where is the ships? Okay, so we just gotta get right up here. And there's a gun case there. Chicken and rice from where?
But guys, thank you for over 800 likes on the stream. I do appreciate it. All right, we're almost in position. This area seems clear, though. We don't have to worry about much. Yep, no baddies. Clara, I'm close to Castillo's ships. Muy bien, Danny. You'll be boarding those ships as our assault element. Julio, where are you? I'm in the lighthouse. Sitting pretty with an RPG in perfect line of sight to the ships. Want to hear your voice, Raisa? Top of the tower, round in the chamber, scope dialed in. One? Focal of guerrillas! Air One is in disguise and my bullets are hungry! Remember, we take those ships and we punch a fucking hole straight to our island. We get one shot at this, Libertad. So I just got a new fail called Viva Libertad, but I don't know if it's... Oh wow, it's got a laser sight on it. No, uh, it's got soft targets, fast reload, headshot supreme. Headshots, kill reward. Okay. Oh shit. So I did I not put a charms on I didn't yeah, I didn't put charms on here. Oh, I can change the way it looks too. Do the charms do anything? You guys know me, I'm a shark master, so we'll rock that, uh, shark. Go on the other side. Try it. Let me know if it's any good. Danny, you want to use your camera to check out the defenses on those ships. Look before you leap. If Lita was with us now, she'd be smiling. And halfway to those ships already. If Lita was here, I'd kick her ass for keeping you a secret. Take care of yourself, Julio. Hmm. Camera. Not too bad, but this is just what I can see on the surface. Probably more guys in nooks and crannies that we can't see, but all in all, it's not too bad. Want to disable those alarms for sure. So it looks like each ship has two alarms. Maybe, yeah, this one has two. That one has two. Let's do it. I'm gonna land on the back side of the ship here. Looks pretty clear. Uh, all we gotta worry about is that camera. Okay, I couldn't glide as far as I was hoping. We're coming up into the middle of the ship. It's a little... ...less ideal. On board. This is it, Danny. Clear those ships and don't be afraid of using their own weapons against them. Those turrets pack one hell of a punch. Camera one down. This is Vasquez. Nothing to report.
Doctor! Don't need more soldiers here. Carillo! Captain wants the bird ship scraped off the antenna again! Carillo! I know you can hear me! Got pretty decent high ground here. Raul, come in. Raul, you copy? The issue is this guy has a helmet, and I don't have armor piercing rounds in this. Find out. So there's a crate. I think it's up in the uh, top area here. Tony Anderson with the membership. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you. What kind of core do you need for you? Noah's remote? I actually have an extra core. Look, this is Controller's messed up, but the cable's fine. Sorry about the cable. So I needed a cable for his remote. I was wondering if there was a way inside this top deck area. Weapons crate in here somewhere. There it is. Or the FND crate. Gunpowder. An alarm. Better take out that camera. Now I do have armor piercing rounds on this gun, just not on the other one, the sniper rifle. I'm going to disable the alarm on this, even though I don't think it really matters. Now that the boat's clear, then we got to make our way over to the other ship. I 
minute. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this thing probably does ham damage, but... It's not like I'd be able to effectively kill everybody with it. Now this camera. That camera needs to go. Adios. Oh, excuse me. Kind of trying to do the same plan on this. Already nailed the uh, camera on the backside here, so I know we're clear. One guy up top here. Oh, I never spotted this alarm. But I think there's Don't need more soldiers here. Three on this ship. Yep, one more right there in the middle. I don't think the alarm will matter, right? Like, they won't get reinforcements to come from land, I'm sure. Perfect. Great. Clara, it's over. Let's get the fuck out of here. We couldn't have done it. I meant to jump down and I accidentally hit the jump button twice. Um and activated my parachute. I'm going to hang back, set charges, and make sure those ships are blown to shit. Check in when you're done with you. Danny. Adios, reinforcements. Where are you, Clara? There she is. There's Clara.
What's a chicken and lamb shawarma? I don't even know what that is. What is that? Us. Viva Libertad, Danny. I'll try it without it. There it is, set. We almost sealed Team Six to both of them, but a little, a little bit of a miss. Hell of a firework show. Have to give you credit, Clara. You fucking did it. We did it, Danny. That was I the did difference. it. Come on. What's I... your plan when you reach America? Me and my friend Alejo were going to work shit jobs until we could scrape up some money, open a body shop. If the Yankee blockade taught us anything, it's how to keep things running when you got nothing. That's the dream. Sure, Yankees might pay you to park their cars or pick their fruit, but you'll never be one of them. The American dream doesn't come in our color. Okay. If we're shitting on dreams, what are you going to do if you win, Presidente Garcia? The next president won't last six months before they are assassinated. Wait, what? It's the truth. Won't free elections solve that? What happened to your list? It's a vision, Danny. But I'm not as naive as you think. This revolution will free Yara, but won't fix it. When we take the capital, Yara will be burning. It will be civil war, factions, warlords, born back coups. Take your pick. Yarans will be killing Yarans for a generation. Uh-huh. This fight will take the rest of my life. Yara is stuck in a cycle of tyranny and revolution. My job is to show us how to break it. This isn't a dream, is it? You have to do this. What makes you say that? No one would choose this. No, Danny. Everyone who follows me, who joins Libertad, chooses this. But you know, I can really see you stocking shelves in one of those giant Yankee supermarkets. <laughs> Fuck you. No, no, no. I just think you'd look good in a little uniform, name tag, maybe a fancy apron. Leave me out of your fantasies, Clara. Uh, EQ, thank you so much for this super chat. <laughs> I appreciate you. How you doing tonight? Have I ever burned myself with the muzzle of a weapon? Oh, of course. My favorite guerrillas. I missed my island. Tonight we celebrate. I'm sorry, Hefa. What's wrong? Julio never checked in. Either that will kill you fucking through your eyes! Traitors! Criminals! How'd they capture him? Oh. <sighs> Mio, the difference between a true yarn and a fake yarn eh, can be hard to see, but it's there. A true yarn understands that loyalty to country is key to his survival. Not justice, not love. Not even family. Loyalty to a vision that looks beyond themselves. Come oh, mierda. <laughs> Fake yarns love to be the outcasts. They are addicted to their selfish perversions. Chaos. Lies. Like wild dogs. But dogs can be broken. They can serve paradise. And if a dog refuses to break like Julio here, like Clara Garcia, like Libertad, then we must put them down. Papa, you've proved your point. Put Julio down. This is a difficult step to paradise, Mio, I understand. But when you achieve our vision, I promise you, there will be 
No more steps. I'm coming, Lita. Fine. Then, enjoy the show. Fucked up, dude. Honestly, man, a mercy. It did shoot him. Julio checked in. Proof of death. Join your friend Lita in a suite hereafter. I keep my promises, Danny. You wanted a boat, you got a boat. It's a beautiful piece of shit, but it'll get you to a Yankee beach. One with the naked fatties. You two are just gonna let me leave. Bullshit. You could have sold us out a long time ago. You're my best, Kiria. I can't promise you victory, I can't even promise you survival. What I can promise you is this. You are the lucky one. That usually work? 50-50. This can be the end of the game if you want. Really? What do you actually just get on the boat? I bet this fucking boat will sink halfway to Miami. What do you like? You actually get on the boat and leave? Yo, Far Cry is so crazy with all those, like, um,. Like secret fast endings and stuff. Doctor Juan, where? Okay, so this is the start of the far as hell. How the hell do we even get over there? With our shitty little boat? Let me, uh... Let me look at getting uh, armor-piercing rounds for this sniper rifle. Armor-piercing poison blast rounds incendiary. We're gonna get armor piercing. Okay. And then. Sniper scope. Both the same price. So we'll go with this. So now my sniper rifle is fully decked out. I can hit armored guys, and we're, we're, we're good. We need more. We need more gunpowder. So what's all on this island here, though? There's a uh, store. I want to go check. Ah, my favorite guerrilla. So many fun ways to fuck up soldados. Want me to make you the best supremos and resolver weapons? You need depleted uranium. Lucky for you, Castillo has stashed his supremos. You'll be back. Yeah, I found they always come back. Fire wants weapon. Oh, okay. So we could get um, stealth supremo, emit an EMP pulse to knock over enemies, disable security systems, and enable vehicle. Oh, that sounds freaking sick. Saboteur create chaos by launching poison gas on a battlefield that can turn enemies against each other. And then this one emits an explosive ring that. Okay. Want this. So we'll get the stealth one. Oh, and these are other weapons. So what is this? This is like a cross. Oh, it's like a crossbow. Bro. 
sprays poison. Oh, this is a nail gun. Stand and reload. Projectile impales enemies. Projectile tables. So is this crossbow not very good? For, no, it seems good for stealth. Which one would you guys say? Per crossbow or... Or nail gun? I don't know. Nail gun seems a little funky. That's not really much. I'd rather just use a gun with a suppressor at that point. Yeah, we'll go we'll go with the crossbow. Nail gun OP for stealth. How is it any better than a gun with a suppressor? So we got a new stealth supremo. Which oh look, there's a bunch of different ones. <clears throat> I didn't even swap over to my I, I gotta remember to swap on my gear depending on the sweat those different situations remember the right tool for the right job right oh the nail gun has no yeah I mean at that point though I mean I don't know I feel like I could just control my shots a little better but we'll try them all I mean there's no reason not to right all right, we're going to go check the store. I'm also going to equip the uh, crossbow thing. I mean, I might not even need the crossbow once I actually unlock a real bow and arrow. Okay, let's see. Is there... An actual store here, though. This is a weapons crate somewhere around here. Was that inside? Okay, that was underground. I think that's the icon for the weapon crate, right? Up here. Okay, you can't like jump in these uh or do anything. You just gotta kinda follow the path. Uh, dog tags. <sighs> Modify your Supremos to have grenades. What do you mean? We got the... I do... I did see the little... Gadget mods. I don't understand how these work exactly. We're gonna have to tinker with all this stuff at some point. Oh, okay, you do it at the workbench. Hold on, let me see. Grimo. We got the amp grenades. We have... Molotov. Throwing knives. I don't have grenades right now, like regular ones. Oh, we need more Supremo bomb. 
bond in order to get grenades. Oh, we could put a mod on this too. Right arm pocket, catch your breath. Yeah, I'm not going to waste that. Let's go see what she wants. Yeah, I definitely would not mind having some grenades for sure. Once you're back at Santuario, shake the trees for guns, ammo, new believers. Cassio was surprised. Let's keep it that way. Welcome to Libertad, Danny. I can leave any time. What's the rush? Inspiring. Let's free Yara, shall we? Oh, yeah. This is kind of like, um, like Wildlands, right? Castillo controls all of Yara with soldados, slaves, and blood. The capital is a stronghold. We take Esperanza, we free Yara. Best chance we got to weaken Castillo is to hit military targets like FND bases and checkpoints. But most important, we have to surround Esperanza and trap Castillo in his cage. That means targeted operations that will unite the revolution and make Libertad stronger. To do that, I need you to recruit three groups in Yara to fight with Libertad. Each is waging war across Yara with a different piece of Castillo's empire, all controlled by his inner circle. In El Este, foreign invaders like Mickey Industries suck our resources dry, and Admiral Benitez defends Castillo's poison lifeline. But the old legends of 67 can help us turn the tide. They're hiding in the jungles of the highest mountains of Yara. Their greatest guerrilla, El Tigre, is waiting with open arms to help you bring them on our side. Then we have Valle de Oro. Not just the engine of Castillo's Viviro operation, but also his propaganda machine, run by his Minister of Culture, Maria Marquesa. But I have some old friends who can run our counter-propaganda campaign, Maximus Matanzas. They were the voice of the protests and can mobilize Yara's dissidents to fight for Libertad. They've gone dark. Last seen at a fort in Balaceras. We need to find them before Castillo's forces do. In Madrugada, we have Castillo's nephew, Jose, a slave driver who forces outcasts to grow that poison Viviro tobacco. But the Montero family is waging war against Jose. They hate visitors, but I have intel on a mechanic who has a workshop in Costa del Mar. His name is Fili Barzaga, and he's their gatekeeper. If I were you, Danny, I'd start in Madrugada. We take back that tobacco with the Montero's help, and we got Castillo's Viviro at the source. You just need to find this mechanic, Philly. I'll be here actioning targeted Libertad strikes against Castillo throughout Yara. Hang on. I'm going to get all these groups to sign up to Libertad by myself? How? Simple. You help. Any way you can. Too easy. I send a squad to these groups, I'm an invader. I send a scout, then I'm not serious. With you, they get my best career without politics and bullshit. Just help. Libertad takes the capital, we slit Anton's throat, maybe drink his blood, etc., etc. Then he needs a walk. Viva Libertad, Efa! Yeah, yeah. I'm not Clara's best guerrilla. You are. You're not listening. Translate one. The accent. Clara hides it best she can, but she was born rich. From a family of true Yaren she left behind. She can shoot, bleed, drink with us all she wants. But she can't hide the stink of the upper class. What's that have to do with me? You are an orphan, Danny. Poor. From the dirt. When they see you, they don't see politics. They see they have no excuse. She's using me. See? And you're using her right back. Do you want to kill Anton? Doing good, man. See, do you want to free Yara? Sure you do. <clears throat> but here's what Clara can't say, but you and I both know. You want this. You're a guerrilla. And for a guerrilla, the shit my pants rush of an ambush, the smell of sulfur burning your nostrils, it's... 
It's... It's fun. Don't worry. Your secret is safe with me. I said, go back to the island and go into the cave. I, want the, uh, the, I did see a cave down there. Here, the uh, Olubwa cave. But it didn't look like there was any icons around it, so I didn't think it was even worth going into. There is a gun case here, too. We never went that far up, though, in that uh, area. Okay, so I should be able to fast travel back here too, right? Yep. And we got the dock side. Libertad really started from the bottom. Danny, listen to Juan. You kill soldiers, Castillo's going to send his special forces after you. Know what makes them so special? They're especially trained and heavily armed. Fuck you, smartass. But yes, you've been warned. It's like, uh... <sighs> Far Cry 5 was like that. Um, when you kill too many of the- they would send- what the hell were they called in Far Cry 5? They'd come and like, shrank your ass? <laughs> oh, the angels. No, the angels were the high dudes, weren't they? What the hell is this? I need your help, Lord. I hear asking, but please. Thank you for this benediction. I'm way too far down. You just scared the shit out of me. I'm loving Far Cry 6, having a great time with this, guys. Okay, here we go. This seems like where we need to go. But one thing I've noticed about this one so far is there's not as many animals. Go. Something mysterious about this cave. I haven't seen Triada symbol since I was a kid. Yeah, there is something special in here. I played the first one with the first Far Cry. Yeah, we played, uh, no, I've never played Far Cry 1. I started on 3. We did 3, 4, Primal, and 5.
Okay, so it's a treasure hunt. Ooh. Okay, so we just got some new gear. This one reduces movement and noise. Stealth material. Then a wrist we found here is improved throwing knife. And, ooh, that's pretty good too. We got our, our, our ninja build. Uh, you got to discover the mysteries of the cave. Uh, there's different areas that sell me them. Each uh, region has um, has a relic, so at some point we're gonna have to. While we're in those regions, just kind of check and see if we could find something. I was wondering what this is right here. The cryptogramma chest. Core hoodie. Yeah, we'll mark this chest here. I want to see what it is. Army, thank you so much for the gifted member. I really appreciate it. Whoever receives that, welcome to the fam. And guys, thank you so much. We got over 900 likes on the stream. That is massive. Uh, remember, if you guys want to see some more of this, you know, all you gotta do is smash that like button. It's the best way to let me know if you guys are actually enjoying it. Find the remaining charts to unlock the chest. Uh, so you gotta find certain items to unlock the, that chest. So I want to hit these two, right here. I wonder if this way we can get up and over. I already found one. Oh, they're in that area? Okay, cool, cool. That that makes my life easier then. There's one. I thought it was the chest that was making that dinging sound. Oh, nice. Got that. Got some hazmat gloves to go with the mask. Got a storm coming in.
tanto me guapo. So I want to get in here and get this weapon. Sniper. Shit, a camera. I'm hoping I can knock out this uh, sniper, no problem. Perfect. Go. Medic can't save you. See if there's a looks like the fence is pretty solid all the way around. Maybe that back area there, there's an opening. If I clear enough of these baddies here, we could probably just if I clear this guy, I think we could just go right through the front gate. Doesn't seem like it's very heavily guarded. Why didn't the fucking parachute deploy, dude? Camera. Disable the alarm and we're good. Alex Rain, thank you so much for the membership. Welcome to the fam. Okay, though. No, I don't want to kill the dog, chat. I would only kill the dog if I had to. Okay. Thank how you doing? So we got the L General Modified Scorpion. I did not hear that in my dog killer instincts got act.
I didn't kill that dog, chat. I didn't kill that dog. What do you mean? The guy that I was that was over there shot at me, right? And then he shot the barrel and killed his own dog. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. Don't try to put that on me. All right, so we're going to head back over here and then we're going to travel on ship to this island, but where the hell did we have to link up with the... Yeah, there's a lot going on in this island, isn't there? Holy crap. Let's see the mission for it, though. Where the hell is the mission? There we go. This mission. The Monteros. There it is. So we gotta meet him uh, at his workshop in Costa Del Mar. So we could take a boat. We'll just kind of sail up into this cove here. Let's go ahead and fast travel. Oh, no, no, no. Hold on. Let me go up the road here. And get this cash. Might be gunpowder in there. Shit. A big group of enemies. Got him. Now that stealth supremo that I have doesn't like turn out lights and shit, right? Over there. What if you could shoot out lights? No. Oh, Matthew, I appreciate that. I'm glad you're enjoying them, man. Nice, another gunpowder, baby. We got what we came here for, though. Will I be playing Final Fantasy? That that comes out this summer? Yeah, I mean, I wanted to try out uh, Final Fantasy VII Remake. We actually uh, I got a couple games that we're juggling around right now that we're going to potentially be starting this week. Um, Final Fantasy was one of them that we were discussing on Discord. It was uh, Final Fantasy 
Deus Ex. Hey, um, can't spell weapons crisis. without workbench. Control. This. There was a couple of them that we were discussing, and I think ultimately I ended up deciding on Crisis and Deus Ex. But we'll see. Because the only thing is, I don't, I don't know if I'm ready to jump down that Final Fantasy uh, rabbit hole yet. All right, so there should be a dock down here, right? Okay, so we can call for water for vehicles here. We got, ooh, nice. And it has a, a gun on it. Sorry, pal. You're gonna have to swim. I have the remakes of Crisis, so we'll be doing... I have a Crisis 1, 2, and 3 remake. Um, and I have Final Fantasy 7 remake. Okay, so they do have enemies out here patrolling the waters. Even oh uh, yeah, be so go that way. Yeah, so Crisis and, uh, because I, I figured the Crisis, um, the reason why I ended up ultimately choosing Crisis and Deus Ex was because I feel that they'll be faster games to beat, Clara, then I can just move on to the other ones. Again. You want Carlos Montero, the leader of a group of farmers trying to take back their land from the army, but he'll never meet with you. Why not? He's what you would call old school doesn't like outsiders and doesn't trust anyone except family. Great. Don't worry. Philly can help you. He's your in. He's at his shop near the Martinez airstrip. Ah, <sighs> nothing comes easy. Nothing worth fighting for. Suerte, Danny. Uh, but yeah, so I ended up deciding, you know, the Deus Ex would probably, I, you know, I don't, how many hours would you guys say? Generally games like that I would say in 20 hours max. Um, same thing with Crisis, maybe 10, 12 hours. Deus Ex 40 hour game? No, I'm, uh, I'm not playing Deus Ex the very first. I'm, I'm starting with uh, Human Revolution. Human Revolution, then there's like another one, and then Mankind Divided, I think they're called. But then I was like, but I'm pretty sure the Final Fantasy VII remake is probably going to be quite long. But who knows? I mean, the Final Fantasy remake could not be long at all. And I was just spitballing. What kind of person works in a place like this? 
I, I personally like six a lot better than three. Three was honestly my, my least favorite of all the games. I like the the the, uh, the enemy in three, but I, you know, I remember I played three last year, and it just felt super super dated compared to the, these ones. You know what I mean? Intercepting supplies. So we just got military targets. Are you Philly? I'm Danny. No, 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 Philly here. As the whoa, what's in your bag? Know what I can find him. Cerveza. So who's in charge? Everything got another purpose. And you come here for a second. Did you just come here? Can you hold that down for me? That's a dead man switch. One move. So, why are you here? I'm with Clara from Libertad. Didn't she say I was coming? Clara, Libertad! Those are big names to throw around. <laughs> Chorizo. But I don't see Clara. I only see you. So why are you here? Got family to save? Got kids? No! So what do you want out of this? I want my Game finger off road this road switch. To Vostok, I don't want to know who's going to have me years experience. Keep up the good okay. work. Dr. Gary, thank you so much. I really appreciate the super chat. So you're Clara's hero, huh? I'm no hero. That's what he said, what did you want? Philly magic, baby. Want us to help you with that? You need Carlos Montero, our backbone. His family is going to save our land. Great. Take me to him. No, 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 no. Step one, Philly needs to love you. Step two, Baby Montero needs to love you. Baby Montero? <laughs> See that? Chorizo, come on, let's go back. La Espada, his daughter. You know, last time I heard, she went to hit that outgas plantation east of here. She likes you, you're in. A good luck finding her. La Espada, oh, man, she's a fiera. <laughs> oh, 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 next time I see you, I want to play with that crazy backpack, deal? No. But then don't let the poison get you down. That yeah, dog was hella cute. Don't kill, I'm not going to kill the dog. Come on. It's not even possible to kill that dog. And if it was, I wouldn't do it. That's a bunch of savages, man. The Blue Hole Cave is off limit to swimmers of all. Ooh. Definitely sounds like somewhere we want to go, right? Not. So, do we get. Uh, there's airplanes here. The Mongoose, man. There's Blue Hole Cave. A lot of treasure hunts here. The treasure hunts are going to be dope. I actually don't mind doing the treasure hunts and stuff like this because you actually get, like, weapons and cool shit. Ooh, we do have access to a plane already. Okay, awesome. All right, so we're going to... We got to go over here and link up and meet Montero's daughter and try to get our, get into the group. But, you know, it's truly open world, so we don't have to do anything. You know what I mean? We could do, do our own thing. Uh, oh, look at this. So it, it, it actually tells you if we clear this military target here, we get, uh, we get gunpowder from that and the, uh, Oh, yeah, 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 look at those. All right, guys, so we're going to end this here. Um, 
Thank you so much. We got almost a thousand likes on this stream. Uh, remember, if you guys want some more Far Cry Six, uh, hey, to smash that like button. We'll definitely do uh, be doing another episode, and then uh, yeah, next episode we're gonna pick up. We might clear out this cache, and maybe check out these um, these treasures. But then we'll push over and do the mission with that the family here, her or the daughter. So I'm excited though. I'm definitely excited having a great time with this. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's so much more for us to get into, but there it is, guys. There it is. A thousand likes. You guys are awesome. I really do appreciate it. FF7. Yeah, I'm going to be crunching the numbers. Like I said, uh, I figured it'd probably be faster for me to beat Deus Ex and Crisis. And because, you know, I could play Crisis and nobody even wants to watch it. And then we could just move on to something else. But just so you guys know, Final Fantasy VII, Control, Crisis, Deus Ex, those ga games are like right on the forefront of games to be played. So. Uh, in this, obviously. But uh, thank you guys again. If you have it on your way out, a smash that like button if you guys are enjoying the content. Uh, if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. I'm going to go eat dinner, and then um, we're going to be jumping out and playing some more GTA Online tonight. So hopefully I'll see a bunch of you guys over there. If not, you have a great rest of your night. And uh, I don't know who how long it takes to casually run. A 95 hours that's a long time yeah i don't really ever 100 percent games because obviously it's just too grindy but uh when's arc so we 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 did arc on the second channel just the other day if you haven't caught that episode make sure you guys go check out the second channel because that's where we have arc content um the last episode of arc we did on this channel did very bad guys like when i say it was one of the worst streams i've had in a long time um so I kind of backed off and I'm like, I I did the, the second stream. I did it over on the second channel and I was like, well, I'll, I'm going to do another one here in the next few days. We'll, we'll give it another shot. But if not, I'm going to end up only doing the main stuff on this channel and we're just going to do everything else on the second channel. Cause it was, it was a very, very bad stream. Um, but like I said, I don't, I don't, I don't doom games to, uh, to the bottom of the pile unless they perform poorly multiple times in a row. Um, but yeah, it was just the other day was terrible. If you guys haven't checked out the last arc episode and you guys want to kind of pump it up a little bit, make sure you guys to check it out. Cause yeah, it, it seems like not a lot of people watched it, um, you know, compared to the people that usually watch it. So I don't know what happened there, but, um, yeah. All right. But thank you guys again. I do appreciate all the love again. If you haven't smash the like button and, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.